Welcome back to Mustang Media. I'm Isaac Morris. And I'm Max Schaefer. Our first story is about fall sports team captains. Holy story. Well, let's get to know some of our SC fall sports team captains. Hi, I'm Kaylee Jones. I play volleyball. I'm an outside hitter, and I'm a senior. Come to the volleyball games. They're really fun. We need more people in the stands. Join the team next year. Um, my name is Aaron Wilson. Um, I'm a senior this year, and the sport I play is soccer, and I play in midfield. Um, it's a really exciting season because we have a really young team, and uh, we did lose a lot of seniors last year, but I'm having a really good time just uh, getting to know everyone this year. I'm Israel Torres, middle linebacker, and I'm a senior this year. I'm pretty sure we will come out victorious and come out with a, a winning streak, hopefully, and hopefully uh, win like the second round of the playoffs and maybe get a state title. Besides holding everyone accountable, I just try my best to stay up and stay prideful. Our coaches hold an election and then as a, as a group, our team comes together and votes on the five team captains. We are SC. Thanks, Liam. I can't wait for tonight's first home game. Our next story is about the pink out. Mustang media reporter Josh Warner interviewed a few Stuka members. Football season is upon us, and there is no one better to represent that spirit other than the Salina Central Student Council. We chatted with Spencer Angel about why you should join Stuco. It will build your communication, leadership, and organizational abilities, and it will also show colleges that on your resume when you apply, or if you're going to apply to a job as well. We also spoke to Isabella Rubino about the selection of the student section themes. Um, usually our maroons choose our Stuco themes, but this year our Stuco had some say in it, and um, we had a meeting about it, and we bounced a lot of ideas back and forth. The Pink Out game is next week, September 20th, against the Salina South Cougars. Make sure to come, and let's send it back to the studio. Thanks, Josh. You know what I'm in the mood for, Isaac? What? I'm in the mood for Take it away, Ethan. Welcome back, sports fans. Since the last time the football team lost their season opener against Eisenhower 21-14, to and I'm glad I'm not a betting man because I would have lost the farm on that one. The theme for tonight's game is USA, so come to the home opener against reigning champion Derby. The tennis team won 4-0 and their meet. Cross Country went to Manhattan Saturday for their first meet. And in the college football game of the week, LSU trounced Texas 45-38. to Is Texas really back? NFL fans. Antonio Brown is now in New England after a, well, interesting offseason in Oakland. And in a new addition to the report, bull riding for beginners. This week's trivia is the rider has to stay on for eight seconds for a qualified ride. See you all next week. Thank you, Ethan. And of course, our Friday wouldn't be complete without a Reed fact. Fun facts with Reed. It's Friday, and you know what that means? It's time for a fact. Did you know that the longest wedding veil was the same length as 63.5 football fields? That's as long as 22,843 feet. Thanks, Reed. Don't forget, my sayings, our first home football game is tonight at 7. I'm Max Schaefer. And I'm Isaac Morris. See you next time, Mustangs.